Hi everyone, it's Neil from Big Science. This experiment is called pressure ping balls. All you need is two ping balls, some plasticine and two straws. To set up pressure ping balls, it's nice and easy. You just need one big little plasticine there and you stick your two straws in. They need to be able to move, so just check that they move. Then we get our ping pong balls with some plasticine stuck on those. Stick that in there. So to do this experiment with pressure ping pong balls, what we're going to do is we're going to blow in between two ping pong balls. Now, what you might think might happen is when you blow against the ping pong ball, it will move away. It will move with the force. However, what will happen as I blow in between the two ping pong balls, hopefully they will come together and touch each other. So why did the two balls move together and not apart? Well again, it's all to do with air pressure and Bernoulli's principle explains this one really well. So what Bernoulli observed was when air moves quicker, it becomes a low pressure. So when I move the air in between the two ping pong balls, so the, it's moving quicker than the air on the outside of the ping pong balls, the pressure in between is lower than the pressure on the outside. So the pressure on the outside of the ping pong balls is at a higher pressure, so it pushes the ping balls together into the low pressure. So hopefully you've all enjoyed pressure ping pong balls and we hope you all give it a go at home. And remember, please try and send any clips or photos of you doing at home across the water here at Big Science. And also please check out our YouTube channel, Big Science UK. Thank you very much.